athletes who are shooting for the Olympic Summer Games down the road. And last week, they took their first steps towards that goal. Eight-year-old Jamil Maldonado and 10-year-old Hiram Correa became kings of the ring when they each grabbed championship belts at this year's Silver Gloves boxing competition. At the Azteca Boxing Club in Maryville, the road to a championship always begins with the basics. And just over a year ago, 8-year-old Jamil Maldonado and 10-year-old Hiram Correa were right here, working on the basics. Early on, Coach Jose Lopez could see Jamil had something the other kids didn't. It's speed. His speed is phenomenal. He's, he's very, 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 very quick. Hiram played some soccer, but he was looking for something a little more challenging. It looked like it was going to be a cool sport for me. Their natural boxing abilities took over. Jose had a couple of diamonds, and all they needed was a good polishing. The boys were dedicated, working out five days a week to develop their speed, their power, and their technique. By December of last year, the boys were ready for the annual Silver Gloves boxing competition. In California, they battled to regional victories and a shot at the national titles in Kansas City. Coach and boxers punched up their training. We did so many uh, other type of drills. It's not just uh, what we do uh, as in, you know, just regular hit the bags and this and that. All the hard work finally paid off. Jamil captured the 55-pound title. He says by logging a whole lot of sparring time back in the gym. I spar with baby kids that are older than me and that are that way more than me, and, and I get the experience with them. And Hiram used a stinging jab to win the 60-pound title. The champ says he focused on his technique and a winning strategy over the last few weeks. The preparation before a fight, but it's the hardest part, but there's no problem because I like to do it. How about that? Just love that, don't you? Hey, congrats to Jamil and Hiram for winning those titles, and they're eager to, eager to build on their success. Both guys are intent on working their way up to silver gloves, to the golden gloves, and will hopefully represent USA in the Olympics in maybe, what, 2024? Maybe. Wow, those are tough little tykes, Coop. Don't want to mess with them. Well, here